from New York to Tirana, Janix is here. Janix, how are you? I'm very well. How about yourself? We are happy to be here. And I said from New York to Tirana because you actually don't live in Tirana. That is correct. However, all my family is here, so I'm pretty connected to Tirana. And of course, you're happy to be here during the holiday. Yes, I am very happy. Although, as I said it earlier, it's kind of it's pretty chaotic during the holidays in Tirana. It's almost like New York. It's just it's crazy. I mean, all the shopping, yeah, the people. It's, it's, yeah, so many people. Today we were in the Skandenberg Square. On, uh, I mean, it, it's incredible because you know we are in a difficult time in the world, and um, yeah. it is like it's basically no pandemic in Tirana. Yeah, with COVID, who? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Omicron. <laughs> what? What does it mean? <laughs> you lived in New York for the past five years. Correct. Your living in New York has give you some experience to your music. Absolutely, I think it's uh, it's a natural consequence, mm -hmm. and um, I feel like I've grown so much this past five years living in New York and just like you know getting kind of the best of of like the world most like most likely not quite but like yeah it's it's just like it's so great that you have you're dealing with so many like um uh, mul like it's, it's just like the the fact about the multicultural thing that makes it so unique and like mm -hmm. you get to experience a lot of things at the same time which is it's pretty like fast uh paced but like it's also very cool well that's ardit new york as you said is a multicultural city so many languages of course you speak English perfectly, Albanian. What other language? Italian a little bit and Spanish a little bit as well, but more Italian than Spanish, I would say. Has your music taught these languages, like Spanish, Italian? Actually, yes. My previous release, Dejame, is half English, half Spanish. Wow. So yeah. It's amazing. <laughs> Dejame. Dejame. In leave, Spanish, leave, leave me. me. Yeah. Leave me alone. More like. More like about that. yes, yeah. because I'm Colombian, so oh, I speak Spanish. Yes. Nice. Okay. Oh, you're right. Right. Okay. <laughs> and delusional. You participate before in Festival Kingis editions 51 to 53. You're coming back with this song, which is kind of dark. Uh, it gives us this atmosphere. Nice. What is the... delusional means to you? Um. Okay. So the song itself, it's about this type of person who um, can separate reality with. Um, um, with fantasy so it's basically this person who is trying to win back this other person who has made it clear that you know there is no way for return it's just that you know you have to make up your mind and leave me alone basically but this person still thinks that you know there is chance and they can do whatever you know to uh, win back this lost cause I would say so you think it's kind of a maybe a little bit mental issues <laughs> Yeah, that's a little bit strong, but like it can be, you know. Um, even though no, I haven't thought about that in in this song. I haven't thought about that, but um. And you told me you write the song originally in English. Yeah. And you translate it, so it changed a lot the meaning of the song. It has also because I had to adapt it, adapt it in in the Albanian language, which I have to say that is not um, like is not the best fitting language for the style that I sing, you know, for the style of music that I sing. It's it's kind of like difficult um, in terms of syllab in terms of like the, the consonances and all that. So yeah, and um, the story does change a little bit. It's still about delusional, like uh, something delusional, someone delusional, but um, it's kind of sexier and spicier in terms of lyrics. Festival Kingis is a big and very important deal in Albania. What do you think about Festival Kingis fans? I think they grew a lot. Um, as I was mentioning, is it hasn't been like this um, in the past. Where, where I, when I have participated with my sister, it wasn't so like so um, so fiery. It's just it's amazing. I love how much it has uh, grown and like there is um, so many supporters of Festival Kingis, which I, I, I'm enjoying it so much this year. So, yeah. And what about your vision fans? Again, we're talking about a larger number of fans, which are also part of, you know, have become part of uh, Festival Congress and other, you know, European countries. So it's it's amazing. It's just I love how fiery and passionate they are about music and um, 
and the, all kinds of music, all kinds of languages, which is it's it's pretty it's pretty amazing, I think. Janix, thank you so much. And before that, final thoughts for all your all of your fans watching you. Um, well, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for supporting me and everyone, you know, participating in this festival because it's not easy to get on that stage and, you know, like perform. So um, thank you for being there, for being here everywhere. And um, we love you. Happy holidays. Keep rocking. And don't be delusional. You can be a little bit, but not too much, please. Just a little bit. Bye. <laughs>